how can there be or why is there a lot of variation in patent prosecution um, services and the, essentially the value of those services? Um, and the answer to that is there's a wide range of uh, patent prosecution services that meet the minimum threshold to, uh, to, to qualify as being quality work and therefore, you know, being uh, essentially um, up to the standards of trade. Um, most, many applicants do not understand this, however. They think that a patent is a patent and that if, if an attorney gets a patent uh, to draft, their, you know, nine out of ten attorneys are going to draft the same patent or prosecute the patent in the same way. Uh, the truth, truth be told is that um, one attorney may uh, put in much less effort and get a patent issued that on its face appears to an inventor to be a, a good patent, but in fact uh, the attorney has gotten far less coverage for that invention than the, the uh, inventor was entitled to. So um, there can be a huge fluctuation in the value of the patent just based on the prosecution services. All uh, or all levels of which would you know meet the minimum standards of the trade, and also would appear oftentimes to the inventor to all be equally a good effort. In fact, it's sometimes possible that a very high quality patent may appear to be poorly drafted to the uninitiated inventor who's looking for uh, you know the exact same wording that the inventor may use to describe his own technology, which may not be the best vocabulary to use to get a, a very valuable patent.